how to update your POCO F1 to the latest TWRP recovery which supports Android 12 or Android 12.1 encryption. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and we have some awesome great news for POCO F1 users. We now have a version of TWRP recovery which supports Android 12 encryption and in this video I'm going to show you that encryption is working and how you can update your TWRP recovery. So here it is, POCO F1 running Lineage OS based on Android 12. First thing you need to do is you will go to the google play store and herein you need to search for an application called disk info so once you have found the application go ahead and install it and of course all the files all the applications which we are using in this video are linked in the description now once the application has installed successfully we are going to open it next up go into the settings page herein you need to enable the advanced mode and then tap anywhere else and you will have other partitions show up herein search for something called ext so you type on the search bar tab on it and search for ext now if you get something like system underscore ext and by name cust so this means you have a system underscore ext partition and if you do not get anything with system underscore ext that means you do not have a system underscore ext partition now why am i telling you this i am telling you this because there are two versions of twrp available one which is with system underscore ext and the other one which is without system underscore ext so now that you know how to find out whether your device has system underscore ext partition or not you have to download the appropriate version of twrp recovery now i have placed it on my usb otg drive over here because i am running android 12 if i place it on my internal storage i will not be able to access my internal storage because encryption is not working i can also show you that if i go into settings and i go into security encryption and credentials says device is encrypted now the next thing we need to do is we need to update our twrp recovery so for that first of all we are going to turn off our device and boot into our custom recovery which is twrp so once the device is turned off you need to press and hold power and volume up till you see the twrp splash image so here it is i see the poco logo pressing and holding power and volume up and i see the twrp splash image and at that point i can let go of that button combination if your screen locks then all you need to do is press the power button and then you can swipe to unlock and if you get a message about keep read only you have to say swipe to allow modifications and let me go into the settings section and change the brightness all right, so I think that is much better. Now, if I go into install right now, you will notice that my storage shows mumbo jumbo characters. This is because of encryption. So the next thing we are going to do is we are going to attach our USB OTG over here. And once that is done, we are going to go into install. Here in we will say select storage. You get different options. You can of course use your micro SD as well. I will over here select my USB OTG drive and then say okay. So this here is my USB OTG. Now you need to know where you have placed your TWRP image file which you have downloaded. In my case, I have placed it in the notifications folder. So I will scroll, go into notifications. I do not see anything. Why? Because that is an image file. Select install image. And herein you will notice that I have my image file for TWRP which supports Android 12 encryption. Now ignore the file with dot underscore. Select the other one. And on the next screen, you need to select recovery. And then we are going to say swipe to confirm flash. Now this is going to make sure that our recovery is updated process finished without any issues tap on the home button reboot and herein feel free to select recovery this time around so that we can check whether encryption is working or not and at this point you can also disconnect your usb otg in case you want to do that 
and if you want to remove your micro sd feel free to do that as well now i do have the team win splash image on my device again i'm getting the message about keeping system read only i will say swipe to allow modifications go into settings and let me change the brightness one more time all right that should be better we can go into install and bam there it is you can see my internal storage is over here so now let us tap on the home button go into reboot and we can select system now back into android let us unlock our device we can go into settings and then we can go into the security section and here and let me go ahead and set up a screen lock so that we can boot back into our twrp recovery and then we can check whether we are able to decrypt with a password or not so i have successfully set up my screen pin and if i try to unlock my device now i do have to enter my pin so now let us go ahead and turn off our device and then we can boot into twrp by using the same combination of pressing and holding power and volume up till you see the twrp splash image so i see the poco logo and i see the twrp splash image and we have to wait for it to ask us for the password now if your device locks press the power button swipe to unlock and as you can see it is asking me for a password let me enter my password over here four zeros select ok device decrypted without any issues and if i go into install bam here it is i am able to access my internal storage which means android 12 encryption decryption and twrp working like a boss and there it is peeps that is how you update your poco f1 to the latest twrp recovery which supports android 12 or android 12.1 encryption and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you